In my previous videos, I mentioned a couple of times that I like Midjourney most from all the AI generators. But lately I've been using Leonardo AI and I think this is the best AI tool to generate art. Let's dive into it. Here we have the homepage of Leonardo AI and once you're logged in, you're gonna go to launch app. And here you can see this is the starting screen. On the left side, we have the menu. And when we go to fine tuned models, we can see all the modules that Leonardo has. When you look at all these images, you see the example and here is the description of what it does. So basically the only thing you actually have to do is you have to find a style that you like. And when you click on that style, you're gonna use this model to generate your art. So that's how easy it actually is. So let's find a style that we like. So let's click on Leonardo Phoenix because I like this style and I'm gonna click on generate with this model. And now I can generate something with this model. On the left side, we have the settings for this preset. So here we have preset Leonardo Phoenix and when we click on prompt enhance, we can set to automatic. And that way, when we write the prompt, it's gonna automatically make it better. The preset style, I'm gonna leave it dynamic. You can see they have a lot of different preset styles. For the contrast, I'm gonna go for medium. You can also go for high contrast if you want a high contrast image, or you can go for low contrast if you want low contrast. For the generation mode, I'm gonna go with ultra because I wanna have the best one. Let's go for image dimension two by three. And for the size, I'm always keeping it at large because I wanna have my image as large as possible, but we're gonna make it even larger, which I'm gonna show you in a second. The number of images I wanna generate is four because I like to have a good selection of images. In the advanced settings, you can do some more settings, but we're gonna leave them as they are. And now what we have to do here is we have to write a prompt. So what I'm gonna write is a Lamborghini. Because we selected prompt enhance auto, it made a better prompt from our text. And now look at the quality here. These look amazing. Let's pick one of these. Let's say for instance, I like this one. And what I would do next is I would go here. You can see new upscale image. And here we can upscale our image. And look at the size we get. We're getting all these pixels when we upscale this one. So the original was this size. And when we upscale it, it's gonna get in these pixel sizes. And let's upscale this. It's gonna cost a couple of credits. And now we have to wait until this is finished. You can even close this window and wait for it. And let's wait for it to finish this image. So the image is done with upscaling and it's still the same image. Only when you click here, you can now download this image. And when you open up this file, it's gonna be a lot bigger size in pixels. So let me zoom in here. Let's look at the quality and look at the quality, how amazing that looks. Look at all those fine details and you can see how great this looks. And that way you can really create images in big sizes to use for print or whatever you like. And it's gonna keep the quality super good. So that's why I like Leonardo. It's amazing. You can select from all these different presets or models actually. And that way you can really find the best image that you want for your generation, right? So check the link in the description. I will leave a link to Leonardo AI so you can check it out yourself how amazing this is. If you want to see more videos about AI tools, make sure to check out one of these videos. And until then, catch you in the next one.